Security First Corp. Safety through knowledge. How to detect network loop with Wireshark? Detecting a network loop is crucial for maintaining network stability. A network loop occurs when a data packet circulates endlessly, causing congestion and performance issues. Wireshark is a powerful tool for identifying these loops. To begin, open Wireshark and select the appropriate network interface to capture traffic. Ensure that you have the necessary permissions to monitor the network. Once capturing begins, observe the packet flow closely. Look for unusual spikes in traffic. A network loop often generates excessive broadcast traffic, which can be identified by a high volume of packets in a short time frame. Pay attention to the source and destination addresses of the packets. In a loop, you may notice the same MAC address appearing repeatedly. Utilize Wireshark's filtering capabilities to isolate broadcast packets. Filters such as eth.dst equal fffff can help you focus on broadcast traffic. This is essential for identifying potential loops. Another useful feature is the protocol hierarchy statistics. Access this through the statistics menu. It provides an overview of the types of packets captured, allowing you to spot anomalies in traffic patterns. Additionally, examine the time to live TTL values of the packets. A constant TTL value across packets can indicate a loop, as packets do not have the opportunity to decrement their TTL. Finally, review the network topology. Ensure that your network is configured correctly with protocols like Spanning Tree Protocol STP, which helps prevent loops. By using these techniques within Wireshark, you can effectively detect and troubleshoot network loops, ensuring a more stable and efficient network environment. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.